Welcome back to the Price of Business. I'm your host, Kevin Price, talking to you about you and your business. In fact, Wesley Okiki. I, I can't believe I didn't ask you about this in the front That's end. All right. How close am I? <clears throat> You're not too far. It's OKK. OKK. Okay. There yes. we go. OKK. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wesley OKK. And uh, he's with an interesting company called Fruition Labs and the website over there, fruitionlabs.com. Man, it sounds like, you know, something that you would normally find find in just our brief chat before we began in the Silicon Valley rather than, uh, you know, Houston. Uh, but uh, I love it. I think it's very cool. Kind of gives your elevator speech. Well, uh, Fruition Tech Labs uh, was founded just about a year ago, and I'll give you a very quick, brief uh, history um, originally from West Africa, and I hadn't been back to our village in about 20 years, and I went back, and I was really excited. Uh, since I was probably five, I've always been excited about technology and engineering, and, and that's who I am as a person. But I go back to uh, our village, and I'm really excited to see cell phones and other new technology popping up, and I was there for, for a few days, and uh, what came to light was that uh, the basic needs of of living needs were neglected. So the issues and the problems with water was still there. Some in some cases it was worse than where when it was twenty years prior. Electricity, roads, uh, education, and uh, it just it hit me that wow. Even though technology is expanding and it's doing a lot of great things, there are uh, many many situations where technology is is, is only providing entertainment and not helping people with their life. So uh, I, I, from that point on, I, I realized, okay, I need to move direction on kind of my focus with technology and ensure that, uh, even though, ensure that the new things that I will work on with other people or invent, I want to make sure that it, it helps people. Now, you've got six verticals. Yes. Talk about those. So the six verticals or focuses that we try to uh, stay in line with are robotics, Alternative energy, education, which is a big one right now, not only in the U.S., but mainly in the U.S., uh, but in other countries as well. Uh, Biomedical, uh, disaster response and disaster relief, and IT. Okay. What would you say is the largest of those? Well, right now, the largest uh, predominantly here in Houston are education. But for your company, for your organization? Right now, education and biomedical. Kind of yes. give me an idea of what you're doing in the education front. Uh, right now, we have just released. We're actually on the news last night on uh, ABC News 13. Uh, we had a spot there on a literacy program. And this program was developed by an inventor and a school teacher uh, here in Houston. And uh, it's geared for grades uh, first to third grade. And um, we've seen some incredible results with a lot of children that either are slow learners or have dyslexia. And uh, we've taken this, his, his pretty much his technique and the structure of this has really helped a lot of children and is helping a lot of children that we've currently worked with to improve their reading skills. And we're seeing some incredible results uh, within six weeks, eight weeks of them starting the program. And it's, it's basically 50 lessons that last 30 minutes each. Mm-hmm. And they're being uh, used in a classroom environment or in homes? Uh, or? Right now, it's it's started in a classroom, but it's set up. We've designed it to use at home, and we're going worldwide with this uh, right now. We're beginning. To, we're going to launch this in January. Is our goal? So you talk about at your website, which I want to inc- uh, encourage the uh, listener to check out, which is fruitiontechlabs dot com. You've got a five step process uh, yes. uh, to fruition. Talk about those five steps real quick. So the, the five steps are unlock, explore, plan, build, and launch. And uh, part of my background has been uh, on product development, marketing, business development, and sales. And a lot of the startups that we've seen and have heard about and talked to that have not made it or have run into problems at the launch stage is because they have not gone and done their groundwork. And so what we try to do is we've created this, uh, this five-step uh, process and underneath that five-step process, there are about 36 tasks, that give or take. And what it does, it just walks my mentors. It helps my mentors stay on track uh, with every project. It walks them through this process to, uh, to you know, dot their I's, cross their T's, and make sure that everything that is necessary in providing and, and building a startup company 
uh, is done and is addressed. Mm-hmm. Talk a little bit about the um, way the way you're compensated for working with the startups. So we are pretty much compensated when the startups launch and start generating revenue. And at that time, Fruition gets a little bit of equity and, and sometimes commission. And uh, when the company starts making money, then we start making money. So we, our, our group, we're probably about 20 to 30 people right now, mentors and collaborators. And, and myself, I have two other uh, partners that are engaged. And uh, they joined recently, and they're engaged uh, more on a full-time basis uh, with me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Very good. And uh, how big is your team? Our team in, in general is about 20, 25 people. Mm-hmm. What part of town are you all in? We're right on 610 and 288, uh, right there off of 288. Right by Detroit. Reliant. Yes, right yeah. near Reliant Stadium. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, tell me a little bit about uh, how 2014 has gone for you guys. Uh, 2014 has been a, a battle, but uh, it's been good. Uh, we're, we are a startup helping other startups. I think kind of some of the exciting things is we haven't really done any marketing on on new uh, inventors and are just coming out of the woodwork. We're realizing this is such a great need. We're working on about 14 startups currently, uh, and it's just been how many uh, hit the ground? About 14. Yeah, wow. We just hit the ground running. We have another four to five that we haven't taken on yet, just because we are working on bringing in new mentors. We are, we're really looking for mentors from different backgrounds and. Uh, careers uh, to help us out. Mm-hmm. And I guess the mentors get a piece of the action as well. Yes, they do. Everybody yeah. does. The collaborators and the mentors, it, it, we create a team, and they some of the mentors, the collaborators, may be, become part of the company. They may join the company at the end. But yes, uh, Fruition uh, uh, acquires uh, some benefit revenue, and then we, we basically divide it up with the mentors and the collaborators. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. I love what you guys are doing. I think it's fantastic. We need to cultivate uh, this kind of uh, growth and, and exploration, and I, I, I really appreciate you telling us your story. Thank you. Yeah, Thank it's you amazing. Very much. It's fruitiontechlabs.com. That's fruitiontechlabs.com, uh, and it's Wesley Okeke. Yes. Yeah, I got it that time. Yes. <laughs> and uh, Hooked on Phonics helped. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> yeah, another great, you know, uh, entrepreneurial educational product that made a fortune. So yes, uh, it, it just proof that those kind of things can work. I want to encourage the listener. Uh, they've got great, uh, great videos there, really logical breakdowns on how they operate. You go check them out there at fruitiontechlabs.com. And Wesley, thanks for your time. Thank you very much, Kevin. All Appreciate right. It. When we come back, much more for you. I do want to remind you, best content here shows up over there at usdatareview.com. While they're liking it on Facebook, follow it on Twitter. And you're listening to The Price of Business. 